Welcome to Deep Thought. Calm yourself when facing problems. Let me get a little deeper. I'm going to tell you what, no matter what the problem is, you can think your way through it. No matter, I don't care what's happening, whether it's man-made or especially man-made, even a problem of nature. You know what? A hurricane hit your house. Now, think of imagine that scenario. That's definitely an act of nature, right? But you can think your way out of it. Did you have insurance? Or even if you didn't, you can still think, okay, how can I... You can think on how you can like deal with that issue. But before you even think, you gotta calm yourself. See, one of the problems when people have prop when issues come up, things happen, people get excited. People get excited like, oh wow, let's 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 do this. And then they jumping around and stuff, and all they have to do is stay calm. I give you an example. I saw uh like I check my um, YouTube accounts and everything every day, every say several times a day, cause you know, I'm responding to people, uh, blocking people <laughs> and everything, right? But I had looked at, uh, it was yesterday, in fact, yesterday from when I'm recording. And I saw that my revenue on my main channel was zero and you know, I'm like, well, wait a minute, that's major. I make a lot of money there. But I didn't get upset. I just said, okay, I might have to contact some people. I stayed calm. One of the things I've trained myself to do, oh yeah, and it wasn't any issue, it was just a glitch. It was fixed like in a few minutes without me doing anything. But I stayed calm, I didn't get upset. One of the problems that people have is they get upset. They get upset. They have a problem and they're like, oh, it's this great thing. It's like, no, no, calm yourself. There's a way out of it. I don't care what it is. You got to stay calm. And one of the things you want to do is practice staying calm. Practice being at peace. That's one of the things you want to do, you know? You want to practice being at peace, you know? And I had to make sure my timer was on here. Now, hey, that's an example. I'm going to use that because I have a timer when I'm doing these videos. It wasn't on. Now, do I get upset and start over? I say, no. I don't just talk. And see, I got calm music on. Now, to get calm, practice meditation. Meditation. Just sit down and... Just try to, you know, sit down, you know, Indian style or whatever, yoga style rather, and practice it. Or it could be you just sit in a seat. You could be walking or something. Whatever you do to make you calm, maybe it's watching something on TV, it calms you down, reading something. You want to do that. You want to practice being calm, being at peace. That way when problems come up, you're not reacting, you're not excited, you're not having too much emotion, which is in motion when it happens. You stay in calm, it's like, oh, okay. Like a few weeks ago, I had busted one of my tires. I stayed calm, but then I busted another one a couple days later. <laughs> but through it all, I stayed calm. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, I had to think about it. Okay, I gotta pay more attention when I'm driving. Okay, but I stayed calm. I was able to solve the problem. You know, of course, they said at the car place, they said, yeah, we're going to clown you, come here a third time. <laughs> and I was like, hey, y'all deserve to clown me. But even driving, it's like, okay, let me stay calm. I'm going to tell you what, calm you. I don't care what the problem is, calm yourself first. And then in that moment, when you're very calm, the answer to solve the problem can come right away. And even if it can't, calmly, you can calmly figure out, okay, what do I need to look at to solve this issue? See, that's, that really is the issue with a lot of people. They get excited or they look outside themselves. And we all know it. Some of y'all might be that type of person. Something happens like, oh, this is happening. This is terrible and everything. Yeah, well, hold up. If it's a man-made problem, 
you can solve it. If it's a nature problem, you can still think about how you're going to react to it. I don't care, and I don't care what it is. I don't care what it is. It could be another person. Let's use that for an example. Because let's be real, we get upset by what other people do. What do you do? What do you do? You know? You sit there and you be like, oh, okay. Now, calmly you might think, you know what? I need to, depending on the situation, maybe I need to confront this person and calmly tell them, hey, leave me alone. Or, you know, like if it's online or something, calmly block them. That's something that I do myself when people come with some dumb stuff and they think they maybe might be upsetting me. It's like, you know, I'm like, block very calmly. Because you, you don't want that. Because, and let me talk about that person thing. You get some people, they, get, they actually get off upsetting other people. I, t I told a story before of when I was at the Harlem Book Fair and I was almost about to get in a fight with this guy. He was taking joy in thinking, oh, you won't be able to sell any books. And for 10 minutes, he was right, for 10 minutes. But then I went back and I made a lot of connections there. But I was thinking about what he had said. He wanted to mess up. He wanted to, like, uh, upset my peace. And you get some people like that. You get some people like that. But if he's calm and peaceful, it messes with them. If you, like, they saying something, even if they messing with you directly, call themselves roasting you, you're like, okay, yeah, yeah, you're right. I got this and that. Notice how upset they'll get, because you're staying calm and stuff. But see, here's the thing, you're not doing, it's not like you're not gonna do anything. See, staying calm then in that moment, always remember in that moment, you can think about what you need to do. That's the important thing. You can think about it, you can come up with a solution. Because when your mind is all over here and all screaming and stuff, you're not thinking. And sometimes the solution is very simple, no matter what it is, you know? Like I said, when I, when I checked uh, my uh, account, it had zero on it. My YouTube revenue, it had zero. And I said, oh, okay. And I was already thinking about what I needed to do. Thinking, thinking about the options. Say, okay, I need to contact somebody. I need to see what's up. But it was solved in a few minutes. It was like, cool, I wasn't upset. See, that's important. See, calm yourself. When I talk about deep thought, it's all about stimulating your thinking. See, I want people to think, even when you disagree, I want you to think about it, all right? I want you to think about it, all right? So that's very important. Whenever you're facing a problem, calm yourself first, and then you can solve the problem. In that moment, all the possibilities of what you need to do comes to you. But you can't when you're not calming yourself, all right? So anyway, that's all I have for right now. I want y'all to really think about this. Really, I mean, seriously, really think about this because going through life, we're going to have problems. I don't care who you are. I don't care how good things are going. Something will come up. I don't care what it is. Some will come up out of the blue never fails but you want to you want to build yourself make yourself somebody who when that comes you just like all right let me take care of it that's how you want to be all right so that's all i have once again i, I think I, I i'm finished for right now and i'll get back with y'all peace and blessings <laughs>